Okay. You can't beat me. You'll just make me richer. Okay, so yeah, I saw you watch the thing yesterday, so you have an idea of the co-op meta. It's pretty much the same. Except... Yeah, yeah it, it, the, the builds form at the pace of turbo because you're sharing them, but the economy is a little lower. That's the way yeah. to do it. Don't let up. Alright, so we are now live on Twitch and YouTube and we just wait to uh, before I do your intro, I'll actually wait till we have a, a couple of people watching. Yeah. Always takes a little bit to get going. Oh yeah, for sure. What's your uh, what's your favorite board at the moment? Uh I kinda like this glacial one. Uh, I think Mini City's garbage anyway. But I, th I have yeah, all the that that glacier one looks awesome, but I'm not sure I can uh, justify spending. I think it's like thirty bucks Australian on it. Oh yeah, yeah, it's about that Canadian. I don't even have any trial but cards for that one. Chess Spirit came out. I just bought like the six thousand, even though it was like 140 Canadian. Yeah. And then I got like 1300 left, and I just like bought everything in the shop. So I have everything permanent that's viable in the shop except for Mini City, because I refuse to allow them to think that's a fair price for a board. <laughs> yeah, that is <laughs> crazy. That's like eighty bucks or maybe sixty. I can't remember, but. Uh, so if they which dropped version it to of the... 30, like Glacial, I'd buy it instantly, but I'm, I'm not letting them charge me <laughs> to tickets for it, like that's ridiculous. Which version of the Chess Spirit did you purchase? The regular premium or the elite premium? Oh, I've got the elite one, so I'm at level yeah. 50 something right now. Yeah, I think I just ticked over 50. So that's why I'm rocking the uh, the Postman character. What's his name? Mailman yeah, Finn. Yeah. He's got a slightly weird voice though. All right, so we'll jump into a game, but before or while we're queuing up, I will introduce you to the stream. So for those of you that don't already know, I'm playing some co-op with Chaos Seraph. If you want to talk about some of your chess rush accolades, mate, go ahead. Uh, I hit queen co-op last season. I don't play solo very much, so I've never been one of the king classic players that everybody knows. Uh, I've placed in every single co-op tournament except for the first one because I didn't know it existed at that point. I usually play with Nate last, or yesterday I guess, I played with Max Eid, who some people might know as one of the King Classic players. Yeah, yeah, definitely a familiar name. Uh, okay, I got double Frost Lotus and Bionic, or er, double Frost Lotus Famine, I guess is the best way to go here. Yeah, I'm just rocking double Hog Riders at the moment. So you actually start off with an extra Crystal in co-op too. Yeah. So you can get four of the units. <laughs> I had cyborgs too, but I figured if Frost Lotus is my double unit, it's better to have an undead. Yeah, yeah. I'm so just gonna leave the cyborgs in the shop. <laughs> we already have one opponent that uh, didn't place heroes on the board. It's a good start. You've made the right well, he got choice. saved by his partner though. <laughs> Yeah, it looks like he's DC'd. Okay, I got two star frost lotus. Easy sorcerer er, easy sorcerer game. Yeah, nice. Uh yeah, which plane got banger, I guess. I got a crit sword. Not very useful. Guess it looks frost lotus get her all a little faster. Yeah, I got shocking dagger, which is pretty useful early. I, I quite enjoy it. That and staff and tome. Don't really have anything that's uh, matching up well combo wise in store yet, though. Yeah. Might just be a week early again. Two star frost with us might carry like one hand or two. It depends on how many people get two stars. Yeah. Let's see. Ooh, I devour early. Alright. Uh, two rider isn't horrible. Two rider. Two undead. Even try to bribe me with just one banana. Mmm. Smells Two nice. furries. Mm. 
So do you have any combos you think are going to work mid-game at this stage? Uh, Sorcerer I'll get there, I just need to grab the units to level up. That Devour is such a nice early find. Yeah. Let's see if time go up. If you play through it, you can realize that like the players are not good. You can play with like the sh worst build in the game and win this. Like it's not that hard. Yeah, sure. <laughs> okay, there's another banger. General Puffer. Ice Tusk, Max Lord. I've got a <laughs> two-star Wish Doctor on my bench, but I'm pretty sure sharing Calamity with you is better. Oh yeah, I'm much better. I don't have my Undead in right now, but just two Riders in general is better than anything a Wish Doctor is going to do. And you already sold it. <laughs> yeah, I sold yeah. so I could level up and get Undead happening. Yeah, for sure. We could put together some kind of warrior front line. That's the way to do it. Don't let up. I'm gonna lose my round, but that's okay. So at this point, is it better for you to have undead from me or the two star hog rider? Oh, you've uh, got famine already. Both. So I'm okay. Sorry, I yeah, just realized yeah. you're running yeah. off famine. So I'm giving you undead. Yeah. All right. So. That means I can fix my team here. I got a two star Wukong, but I think two riders is better for you at this point. That might be better for now. Okay, I'm gonna fix it, sending you a better unit next time. Yeah, yeah, no stress. Do you want Hog Rider or Two Star Wukong at this point? Uh, two Star Wukong's probably better. Yeah. <laughs> Wukong, I reckon Wukong's almost got the, the strength of a three cost unit. He's pretty solid. Yeah. Puffer's probably better than Ice Dust for you. Young people have no okay, you got my shit, so. Ice yeah. Dust, Betty. Yeah, perfect, thanks. Yeah, I figured I'll just roll and see if I can keep the win streak level. Let's sell back these. So, I haven't actually played enough cop to, to notice this, but if I match up against a random opponent, they also matched up against me? No. It's, it's, so it's just pure coincidence this it's, round. Oh wait, no, no, no. Yeah, it might be actually. It's not the same board, like I checked theirs and it was a, it was a yeah, mirror yeah, it's version. Yeah, not the same board, but I just realized I was against the same person too. I usually don't pay enough attention to it. Um, I don't much care who's fighting me as much as who I'm fighting. Yeah, yeah. I found a flame caller, but you have no use to her at this point, do you? Not yet. So it's better to just leave it in the shop for me to I'm get it. Yeah, good call. Cool. Don't even try to bribe me with just one banana. Mmm. Smells nice. I'm you forget basically the... just looking for whatever human swords I can get. Yeah, it's uh, it's funny you forget because most of the game, most of the modes I play are higher ranks, so you forget that some people at this rank just don't know what they're doing. Yeah, <laughs> this is almost Smurf accounts for us playing co-op at this point. Oh yeah, if it felt that way trying to record with Spooby. <laughs> so I had to play on a Smurf to pyro them, and I'm like, oh boy, and then like we actually lost one. So that recording was better because like my first recording I rambled way too much. Yeah. Because I've, I've never done content before. So I'm like, let's try and re-record it. And then we lost a re-recorded game for some reason. <laughs> <laughs> so the video just never got made. <laughs> I will lead the way to victory. Oh, let's go up again, actually. 
actually. Two humans. Super weird that in the leaderboard you're not paired together with your teammate. Yeah. When you view the uh, the full leaderboard. Yeah, yeah, it's really weird. See, it's whoever got the most HP. Yeah. It's weird that the game doesn't have a two-cost human. That it doesn't have what? A two-cost human. That's what I can think of off the top of my head. I'm gonna go look. No, I don't think there is. Oh, Lilith? I think Lilith's no, two cost actually. No, Lilith's human. Two cost human, I was saying. Uh, it's got Frost Lotus and then it skips right to Flame Color, 10.9, and Werewolf. Oh, no Sorcerer, human. sorry. Human, human, not so Human. Human. Yeah. That's hilarious. There, there, I could have sworn. Uh, once I heard you say demon initially, I thought you said demon. Yeah. That was it. It was in my head. All you were saying <laughs> was demon. <laughs> Yeah, Crap, I, should, I, should, I, should, I probably should have leveled there. I got so distracted by trying to figure out whether it was <laughs> human or demon. Alright, it's all good. So you don't mind mistakes like that when it doesn't cost you the win because then your econ benefits. Yeah. I just went to 7 right away because it's like there's nothing at uncommon that I'm looking for. Yeah, yeah. It's like little dragon maybe, but like everything I want is 3 and 4. There's a werewolf. I don't need a wolf pong. Right, right, oh, it's better to do this. Oh, that's your own board. Oh, okay, you got it anyway. I was gonna say I could send you a warlock, but you got your own warlock. So send yeah. you two sides just a little better. Yeah. Yeah, so that's the uh, the biggest skill gap for me in this mode is having to pay attention to your partner as well. I have enough time just paying attention to my own board. Yeah. Enough trouble, I mean. <laughs> I, I screwed uh, screwed up a, a win that me and Nate would have had because I sold my hog rider from our own board and I was like, oh, crap, I was passing that to Nate to give him his, six, his sixth ready. Yeah. And he, yeah, and he yeah. managed to scramble and get a, a second, but like we should have went out fourth that game off my mistakes. Alright, so I can give good you... enough to scramble. I can give you a two star here and now because you've got Warlock already. Yeah. Uh, undead, I mean. Yeah, that's a good call. I'm almost thinking our boards might be strong enough on their own to be both having four Warlock. Yeah, yeah, that'll be interesting. Unfortunately, I sold my Marsh Lord because I never really think to run more than two. Yeah, but I have like misfortune that Mars Lord knew that. Yeah, and all sweet. The okay. Demon yeah, yeah. Things, you know? Yeah, I'm. Um, hopefully, I can find some more of those so I can two star them both. Oh, yeah, if we can both two star our separate warlocks, it's definitely better. Mm, there's a DD LD. Alright, I found my fourth rider, so I'm gonna level again here. Is it worth, but oh, there's a Hunter in the store, is it worth me just buying that so I can give you Hunter as opposed to that two star Hog Rider? Um, uh, probably not. I don't care about Hunter so much. Yeah, yeah, three Hunters. One of those traps probably, to be honest. You don't have Warrior anymore, so... 
Give me a Mark Lloyd's video. I just found a stalker drone. Banger might be better than Frost Lily. You don't have human. Or you've got two human, so. Then you get furry at least. Oh yeah, good call. Good call. Um, They don't do anything for me. Yeah, okay, so this round I'm not like the person I'm fighting isn't also fighting me on their board, so it is just random. It was okay, just coincidence yeah. earlier. Coincidence earlier, yeah. First elimination. That sucks to queue up to a co op and have your randomly assigned partner just DQ immediately. Yeah, that's why I, I've done it like once and had that happen where they didn't, or they didn't send me any units and I'm like, never again. <laughs> <laughs> Um, Just instantly done with it after that. Alright, I'm gonna actually okay. sub in Kraken for Wukong. But you still want that Wukong shared, don't you? Yeah. Uh, I could do without it, it doesn't matter much. If you I'll got better stuff my, to send. I'll keep it on my bench for now. Yeah, I'm, I gave you Kraken. Or who am I giving you? Kraken and Wukong at this point. Okay. Uh, Hogrider is better than Kraken. Especially once. Oh, there. really? Yeah. Because Kraken's position's random? Yeah. I think I might like take a, my first L here. It attempted to stun a Stinger there and it just died anyway. Yeah, so. okay, sure. So until it's two star. And even if it's stunned just a Stinger, I think Hogarty's death card is better. Yeah. We got slot. Oh, can I pull up my DPS even more? Oh, I accidentally bought something and it happened to be Flame Color, so. <laughs> <laughs> I'm trying to see my full DPS here from last time. Yeah, Kraken dealt like a thousand damage to that last fight. Yeah, okay. Yeah, Hog Rider for me actually dealt over 8k, so that's fair enough. I have not found any more copies of my Warlocks. I really wish there was a way where you could very quickly tell which heroes had items equipped. Yeah, to like pull them off quicker, yeah. Yeah. Are you going Sorcerers? I found a Starhorn. No, you're not. Yeah, I'm going Sorcerers eventually, but I don't have it yet, so giving it to me it's not yeah. beneficial, so it's better for me to just pull it. I feel like that is better. This game is going to end before I even get to Sword 3. <laughs> Slash Hammer, it's 5.37am in Germany. I don't know how you're still awake. I would definitely be fast asleep, mate. But hey, I appreciate you stopping by the stream. It worth me I might just grab there's an executioner in the store uh, actually there's a general puffer too which would give you six warriors no I'm not worried about it I'm gonna get out of warriors when I go to yeah. sorcerers right. but the game's not gonna last that long anyway so at least like in co-op unless like it's an absolute necessity to grab it you kind of just build for yourself and then yeah I'm with you so just build your own game, share your strongest units. Yeah, for the most part. And then, like, if you're playing in a high level game, like, you actually have to think about it. But in Pond, we definitely don't. Like, if this was a tournament game, like, considering stuff like that would be good. But Sure.
Like, I've got a four beast, four warrior build, and I'm, like, not losing, you know? <laughs> uh, at this yeah, point, you should probably just give me the thing. other... Give me Misfortune instead of Banga, I reckon. Yeah, yeah. Four warriors. Good on, yeah. This is such an interesting build. Four Warlock, four Rider, three Hunter, three Undead, two Goblin, two Human, and a Demon. Yeah, that's the kind of thing of a pawn. You just kind of take whatever is yeah. coming up in your shot because you're never going to get to a game that's longer than like 20. What's this? Round 18. This is crazy. Yeah. So like this would be over, be over at round this 20. round. Yeah. 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 It's kind of fun that you get to experiment a little bit with builds that might not work at higher ranks. Yeah, like I just grabbed six, six sorcerers, but they're all one stars. I'm not gonna replace my entire team <laughs> of two stars for you know. Let me read Venom's ability. <laughs> Sprays Venom on a random enemy, dealing what two stars for so 750 magic damage every second and reducing the target's attack speed by 60 for 5 seconds. So, it deals damage and reduces attack speed every second for 5 yeah. seconds. That, that, yeah. The text is a little bit confusing there, but it does deal continuous damage. And yeah, the attack so speed reduction ignores ability immunity. That's quite interesting. Yeah, so it actually works on Wukong? Yeah, that's an underrated ability. It's very, yeah. I had to get three star, but I had like no items to go with it, and just like a couple of shocking daggers on it, it was like doing the most damage on my team. Yeah. So here's a question for you, actually. Um, some heroes have magic abilities, or abilities that deal magic damage as opposed to physical damage. Do any heroes de have their base attacks deal magic damage, and is there a way of knowing? Uh, if they do, there's no way to know. Because you I'm feel like sure, some like sorcerers other, would. Other chess games, it's all physical damage on auto attack. Okay. So and, I would assume okay. no. Yeah, if that's the case in all other game, all other auto battlers, you would assume it's the same here. Yeah. Their uh, status screen can use a little work. Their call it mode should get fixed yeah. at some point. I've already talked to Naomi about how to fix it. After ACM went and like blew it out of the water. Yeah, I've never actually played it, so I've got nothing to compare it to. Um, do you need Lightbringer, or have you got it already? I've got it. Like, yeah. I've got the six, but, like, this round's over before I get two-star them. <laughs> I'm gonna I'm gonna chuck Guru out on the board as my ninth hero. <laughs> See if we can win this game with Guru on the board. That'll be all the evidence we need that Guru is in fact OP. Who's... Just, he's actually matched up against me too, so he would have seen Guru. Might as well watch his board, I guess. Can we deal 7 damage? Oh, he actually beat my Guru build. The more I <laughs> That's actually nice because it gives me a chance to put in six sources. <laughs> he beat me on my board too. May have been a little bit overconfident on my behalf. Ooh, Joey, hello. Alright, let's see if he can beat that adjustment. Actually, I might as well go all in level to 10 here and then chuck Guru back in. He'll be matched up with you though this round, right? You gotta come out, you gotta come out, you gotta come out. Okay. So, we'll watch his board I didn't get a again. To oh, he got, he got me again. I, yeah, good. I didn't get a chance to finish shopping either. But. Let's see if my. Oh, you, you gave me Void Doom too. Was that the last round or the round before? 
this round because I sold Misfortune. Yeah. Because okay. I'm like, I sold off my board so that I can yeah. make room on my bench to switch. Yeah. That's a game. That was weird that he played me twice at the end there. I thought it would have alternated between the two of us, but I guess it's still random so that he can't. Predict yeah. It. Yeah, there's a lot of weirdness with wow, the game in general. It kind of makes sense a lot of in a way. Thing they need to do. In co op, when it's in that situation, right, 1v2, if you knew it was going to alternate, you could position accordingly. But then, I guess that that's reasonable. That should be knowledge you have in the game. Because, like, in I, ECM, you can predict who you're going against. Well, we, it's, it's we know random. who we're going against, right? Because there's only one other opponent we can go against, so we can position yeah. accordingly. But, I mean, like, in ACM, they tell you who you played last, and you play everybody once before you go back through again. Right, okay. Until, so, like, unless they, there's, like, an elimination or something that resets it. No. Like, even... I don't know. Like, I never did it in ACM, cause, just because I couldn't care less, but... I'll watch streamers and they know almost every time who they're playing against so they can position properly. Yeah, sure. you can figure out who you played against before. Like, especially in the final rounds where it's like three or, three or four people left. This game, you'll get the same person twice in a row, three times in a row. In ACM, you will fight the other two people in a, in a four. Like, you go one, two, three. You'll fight all three opponents before you fight the same one again. Yeah. So by like process of elimination, they can do it in this game. You can. I can get the same guy three times in a row, and I've had that. <laughs> I've lost a co-op tournament because I got this. Er, I almost lost because I got the same guy three times in a row. Yeah. Which. Yeah, that that's definitely more frustrating. I think in that, like, it's much less frustrating if you get the lowest ranked or the the person with yeah. the worst lineup three times in a row. But if you go against the top person three times in a row, that sucks. That experience yeah, I was on a point fun. where I had to like win streak till the end of the game, and like this guy was <laughs> fighting me down to like two units left each time, and I'm like, okay, I beat him, it's good to go. We'll go to somebody else, and then next round I get him again. I'm like down to two units, and then it's a creep round, and then I get him again after the creep round, I'm down to two units, and I'm like, would you just screw off at this point? Like, <laughs> uh, I'm gonna grab a pair of hunters, start us off. Yeah, I've got double of both. There's another... What? There's another what one that hasn't put... What else is in your shop? Oh, there because we go. if you got something that's better than the Hunters in your shop, something the Hunters back, because I have two of each, might be a decent idea, actually. Uh, Miss Supersonic, Bangar, and Witch Doctor. Yeah. That's not that's a great a first shop. shot. Yeah. So I'm going to grab the Bangar and the Witch Doctor at this point. Two tomes, though. That's nice. Scourge, I guess, for this round. Oh, I got Scourge as well. And then sell the hunters, maybe. And then I'll yeah. get them two yeah, thirds I'm... in the next round. Yeah. 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 I'll put a uh, famine and hog runner back. This is like tournament scraps, but <laughs> like it doesn't matter at this point in pawn. But it's good practice for that, me, that... though. Yeah. Um, is early three hunter decent? I found a forest breath in my shop. Yeah. Better than sending crossloaders if you yeah, can afford to be buying it on your own. I wouldn't cost your own board at that point, but. Um, I've also got undead if you wanted to share famine. Great. Right. Yeah. Oh, yeah, that's even better. Uh, sending your squad is better than hog rider, though. I just did it too quick. Yeah, yeah, no stress. <laughs> I ain't worried in my shop, so I'm just gonna level. I'm gonna need them. This is an easy rider, uh, rider hunter game, so. I guess I could have stayed at that level to try to hit the hog and the famine a little better, but. I think this may end up being warriors for me at this stage, but still nothing really coming together. 
Well, I do have a, I do have some beasts. If I could level the witch doctor, maybe I could move into beasts. Yeah, I'm just, I'm finding riders and hunters at this point. There is a Wukong though, so. Need to find two stars now. Both of us uh, on that warrior yeah. luck from uh, yesterday's tourney. It was yesterday morning for me. <laughs> Did I, he had like a full bench of, uh, of pairs and yeah. find a two star. Do you have Templar Knight? How many no. riders you rock? Not yet. Okay, I'll give him to you over Marsh Lord. Oh yeah, the four. Hey, thanks. Two beasts. Yeah, if it was just three, I would have left him in a shop because it gave you four. I think it's worth picking him up. Yeah, I love the fact you can reassign them now, but having to find where you put them at times can be so frustrating. Yeah. I always just put any armor items on the person who has the passes so that you're not slowing down their mana regen. Yeah. Yeah, that's a great idea. And I think climbing to use skills a little better. This is a great warrior shop, but... <laughs> yeah. A Wukong, a werewolf, an ice tusk, and a horn menace. Yeah. I would have loved all of that. Can't believe we had, uh... Like early D season, both games so far. That's good. People keep solo and pawn. Stops and left. Yeah, that's the risk, I guess, when you run a team mode solo. So, Cat Siren. Oh, there's a. Uh, there's another beast. I think I give up furry for the four beasts. Oh yeah, beasts are really good in Actually. It's not gonna happen just yet, because I need uh no. I need one more level. Yeah. Next round it'll happen. Beasts are good in co-op because they're some of the best things to share. Did you get bonus damage on your board and then you share bonus damage to your teammate and you yeah. do something real quick? Yeah. So at, at this point in time, you still need the hunter and the rider though, right? No need oh yeah, yeah, for sure. But in like a late game situation, sharing a Marsh Toad and a Everbloom or whatever to spawn six extra units is insane. Yeah. Man, still can't find unicorn. two stars. Unicorn is, uh, she's another one, kind of like Wukong actually, that her value feels maybe like a 2.5 cost hero. Yeah. Not quite tier three, but definitely the top end of yeah. tier two. 
four shocking diggers is what breaks her. Four shocking diggers, and she might as well be a legend. <laughs> Uh, I just took another L to that top pair, so we will have some competition. Speak of the devil and she appears. Two of them in my shop. Who'd you find? Double unicorn? Oh, unicorn. You're look okay, so I can stop sharing Templar Knight? Mm, yeah, you could. I'll give you General of War instead. Just oh, yeah, put, him, nice put him back in the shop. I cannot find a two star to save my life. Now, all right, at this point, should I give up, given that every hero I'm running is a one star, should I give up four beasts to run six warriors? I imagine that's the better play. Oh yeah, yeah, for sure. Listen to your elders if you want to win. Sky hasn't fallen yet. That was a nice find, that general of war, round eight. Got my first two star. It's a banger, which is trash. Wow, six warriors. Two furries. Yeah, I think you saw the demon prince too. Yeah, I've, I've got another prince on my you're gonna, you, Yeah, I think you sell him. Because, like, you're going to want executioner in your build. You're never going to use him. Yeah, okay. That'll give me the interest here, too, if I win this, which I should, given it's creep round. Don't even try to bribe me with just one banana. Mmm. Smells nice. This is surprisingly one of those builds that only fight over misfortune. Whereas, like, a lot of the builds fight over a lot of the same units. Yeah, yeah, a lot of the Even if the they're separate end. builds. Yeah. Like, pairing warriors and pairing riders, like, the only thing in common they really fight over is misfortune. You can make a case that they want to fight over Voodoo Elder too, but riders doesn't need goblin buff as much. And I guess if you can run builds side by side that only fight over two heroes, then someone can just share those, and there's really no yeah, competition. Yeah. Absolutely splendid. Let the hunt. It's like you... Warriors kind of wants to go the CC packers package. Riders could do the CC package, but they could equally just do the human sorcerer package in the background too. I just found the uh, gain one crystal witch doctor package in that shop. <laughs> yeah. Um, do you ever bother trying to three star one cost heroes like Banger? I'll do it when it happens. Uh, obviously, I almost always take gurus and two star them. Like I'll save a guru the whole game. Yeah. And then find another one two star and then make a three star with it. But like right yeah, now, I've got an answer two star famine on my bench. Yeah, okay. What are you sharing with me at the moment? Uh, Undead and a two star. It's annoying we can't see it at this point. Yeah, I'm sharing you Scourge and, and, and Calamity so that you get Rider yeah. and Undead. If you get Berserker, I can send you Hog Rider to give you Goblin instead. Mm. You go to I would love to find Berserker. You can't beat me. You'll just make me richer. Don't even... I haven't even started and you're all falling apart. The thing with one star is like even if you're going to do them three star and you don't get them, there's no cost or like uh, Yeah, yeah, yeah. It's not costing you anything. Yeah, that's a good point. Because, like, uncommon, you'll lose two. Force breath, or rares, you'll lose three. Like, you always lose. But, one star, it's the same. Yeah, 
yeah, I guess just if you need the bench space and you not think it's going to happen, then you can just sell them. Yeah. I don't ever try to do it in like, but like I got the two two star famines by like round five, so they were never taking up any bench space. It was just an extra yeah. two star famine just sitting yeah. there. Yeah, yeah, that's pretty nice. Absolutely splendid. Which celebration animation are you rocking? The fireworks? Uh, the, no. Oh, maybe. Uh, I, oh, there's. I, I, okay, I, yeah, I found Berserker. Yeah. Okay. I found uh -huh. Berserker. Yeah, I've got six out in there too. So I can send you Hog instead of Scourge. And then you get Goblin, yeah. your tank items. They should be on my unicorn actually. Need to move them. Keep her alive. Ah, oh, because of oh, course she, she, she does the most damage. Ability. And she's got yeah. a passive, yeah. Yeah. It's gonna be a hard habit for me to break. Game. Like I'm so used to putting defensive armor on General of War along with tomes, but then they're kinda counteracting each other. As long as there's tomes it doesn't matter. Like I'll put tomes and armor on the same unit, but because then it's and not a I'll net negative. On a unit too. Yeah. Uh, I'm less crucial about magic this being on a passive unit. Because you take not as much magic damage. Like it's yeah. only skills. Yeah. And the skill will like fill up your mana bar almost anyway. You don't have to give me undead anymore. I found the misfortune. Okay. Then... This still might actually be the best unit. Yeah, or I guess sure. the items on my unicorn maker are a little better. There's a great sword for ones. The general's tone. ability. Shocking dagger. Yeah, like I got... 2k items, just bad. I'm gonna equip these actually because I want Dragoon. Dragoon the attack speed's worse. Okay, okay. Finding homes for my items, I guess. Yeah, I'm doing the same. I'm nice to hit 50 and I got the higher HP, so I'm not gonna rush the level. I don't care yeah. if I win, so you can just Yeah, no worries. Now nice I could find another general of war or a guru. But yeah, I find people use tank items to be least effective. Cause they're like, oh carry items have to do all my guys with passive. And it's like, well no. If it doesn't matter if your guy deals five attacks a second and dies in two hits. Yeah, yeah, that's a very good point. <laughs> if he dies in like thirty hits and does three attacks a second, that's way more. <laughs> So Famine's a good example of that, actually, because the longer she stays alive, the more effective she is. Yeah, I mean, Famine's an extra special case, because, yeah, the more units die, the more attacks she gets. As a mummy unicorn now, though, because she does a pretty targeted attack, but... Oh, man, I cannot believe... I just cannot find two stars. And then... I see people, and another thing people probably don't think about is putting crit swords with spellbanes. Because, because spellbanes are the amount of damage you do. So if you add a crit sword, right? You know, yes, yes, yes. Faster. Yeah, I've never considered that. Makes so much sense once someone tells it to you, but uh, yeah. some of those things you won't because necessarily if, figure out on your if own. If I only got like one or two crit swords, I'll put them on my mage that I'm trying to spellbane because. It's not worth adding like two crit swords to berserker when I got like a four spell being crack and then I'm done yeah. off like as soon as the match starts, you know? Yeah, that makes total sense. 
I should actually, at some point, we should do a little um, item breakdown because the last item video I did was quite early on in the piece and now items have changed significantly. But having someone like you on the vid as well so you could actually talk through some of that stuff that I won't necessarily uh, figure out would be quite valuable. Yeah, I spent more time with games in general, out of game. Like, I spent like six hours on Fire Emblem Three Heroes just looking at all the data so that I can min-max it. Like, I spent m maybe two hours a day playing, but I'm still yeah. in the yeah. Discord all day. I'm still thinking about stuff for the game. I just can't be uh, bothered to play right now. <laughs> that's, that's, <laughs> in the that's, current that's meta. Nice <laughs> I think the PG word to use there. <laughs> the, the funny thing is for me, I actually really enjoy using Warriors. I think I just got into them quite early on in the piece, so they're just like a comfortable fit for me, so I don't mind the current meta. Oh, yeah, I don't mind it either. I, I just am not happy with the way they did the patch whatsoever. <laughs> I finally, finally gave you Forest Breath 2 star. <laughs> only took 19 rounds to get there. Oh, crap, I forgot that's still over there. <laughs> <laughs> Uh, let's go Blade Finger and maybe a Frost Lotus. I've also got a two-star Glutton that I could share with you, but I'm not sure that it's... No, I've already got my own I did. Yeah. General's such a handy ability. And he's currently two -star, rocking four tomes. Two-star Glutton. Point. No, four and dead's better. Like, yeah, I got right. two hunters in my build that benefit from hunter buff and all my riders benefit from four and dead. I just sold Hunter's Breath mid-battle. I, I don't think it has an effect on the battle. I was surprised I could no, actually no, it do it. Yeah, I'm actually losing to this Cat Zarin guy. Yeah, yeah, he's decent. Hey, he hasn't lost a battle yet. But we'll get there. That's damn old. There's Kraken as well. Alright, so... Glutton. Misfortune. So... I might actually just tome up Miss Fortune now, because her that way her the tomes are getting double effect on your board and my board. As opposed right, to I never just... worry about that in co-op. They just belong on whoever they belong on. Yeah. Like your general ward should be getting them one hundred percent, or even your Wukong. Man, I would love to be able to two star that uh, <laughs> that general of war. Are you kidding me? Oh, okay, never mind. I had one of the armors at three, and I thought it was the resistance cloak, but now my unicorn slows everybody, so that's good. Because <laughs> I got the armor, and I was like, oh man, I thought it was resistance cloak at three, and then I look, and it's like, oh, whew, got the right one actually. <laughs> Alright, I'm just gonna start high rolling now that I'm level nine. And continue not to find anything useful. Oh, I'll be able to two-star Berserker in the next round. So, should I then break up four undead to give you a two-star Berserker? Ooh, that's, that's another spicy thing, because like everybody gets attack speed too. Berserker is such a good unit, maybe. Ah, uh, because you've got Hog Rider, of course. Yeah. Cat still hasn't taken a loss. Yeah, and he's got assassins, so like giving me misfortunes, he just kind of a suicide at this point. So maybe um, better. And I'll give you. I'm going to use Guru on execution. I just scared another two star happenings. So I'm going to give you those two. At this point, do I level up to get four human? Maybe. I got to wait a little bit actually. Alright, so who's he? His matchup against you on his board. Let's see how this goes. You're looking good. I think you might give him his first loss. He's only got a uh, one star sword dancer. It'll change a little yeah. bit once he two stars that. Uh... Oh, on my board I lost. Yeah, I think he's gonna win on his board too, actually. 
just yeah. the, the sustain the from the dodges from the elves. Okay. Yeah, at this point, I sell off my undead. I level up. I go like that. Let's see how I do against him. Uh, you still have general, right? Yeah. Yeah. I Jeremy just general melted. Him in. I just melted him. Absolutely melted him. Okay. Perfect. It'll be slightly harder once he two stars sword dancer, but for now, he's now taking an hour. What items is he? Oh, he's got four uh, great swords and three daggers on her. She is actually, even at one star, really scary. Holy crap! <laughs> she almost outdueled my two star berserker. Oh, I just two star general of war. That's amazing. Yeah, give it to me instead of execution. That was a great shot. There's a shaka acker in there too, but I'm not going to try and get to. <sighs> actually, this is a good question: Kraken or shaka acker? Kraken's stun is slightly longer, but Shakaraka... Shakaraka is overrated. Well, his ability is also bugged. It also stuns the whole board. But it's yeah. slightly less time. But he does have higher HP. Kraken stuns the whole board. And yeah. 30% damage increase. Like. Mm. Yeah, that and that's that affects everyone else that's in attacking, so that is significant. Ah, oh, crap. He did his two start his Sword Dancer, so that's going to change things. Yeah, we might not win this. Oh, no, I'm winning. Can you kill him? Maybe dead. I'm not sure that I'm going to be able to take out his sword dancer. She's... She's basically unkillable at this point. As bad as it is, I almost want to gear my cross with this. Cause she's, cause he's rocking six elves, and she's so itemed up. The shadow giveth life, and the shadow taketh away. Oh, My friends back home must uh. be getting hungry. Damn, she's that one. She's so OP. That nerf didn't really do a whole lot. Yeah. So I give you hog, but maybe something no. Unicorn probably the best. I gotta get her to see star though. I gotta start grabbing extra copies of her. So I realize she's only got like 3,500 3, HP. Yeah. She's got that armor on her though, so she she does tank a little bit. But if she gets crit, she's just like dead. Okay. I know I had a crit sword on somebody. I gotta figure that out. I'm trying to give it to you randomly. Hard on a crib. Boom, boom, boom. This doesn't feel like a good deal. Uh, this entire game, the shop has been so horrible in terms of luck. Is it Templar Knight? I'm still looking at two star crack and misfortune and werewolf. Uh, let's hope that we can actually kill K kill this round so we only have to worry about cat. Yeah. Always oh, against me, he should die. Oh shit. This thing is snuck into my back line. I think you got him. Yeah. I don't know why they're not sh like why Cat isn't sharing that two star. Like it'd be so different if Sword Dancer was on both boards. Yeah. My friends back home must be getting hungry. Okay. My friends back home. Is this like a new farm? Alright. Next round I'll be able to two star misfortune, that will help. I've only found one Joe in this whole game. Yeah, it sucks when it happens. I'm just gonna blow my nose real quick, I'll be right back.
Yeah. You didn't actually mute. <laughs> I've been fighting off this cold for like three weeks now, it's so frustrating. Oh, I still lose to Saren. No, yeah. Dude. Yeah, I can't overcome his sword dancer either. Oh. It's yeah, close, I was gonna say, but... if she switches to general, it'll be good. Just come on, come on. Let's go down. Cool down. Yeah, you're good. General stunning any second. Yeah. I don't know. Oh. No, no. I got Fire. the win because of the time. <laughs> you you would have won anyway. But. Need to find <laughs> something to upgrade to. Alright, so two star misfortune. There we go. That's a bit of an upgrade. Okay. No, I need to. Mm. Void Doom better than a two star Marsh Lord? Probably, right? Void Doom? Yeah. Cost me Beast, but Beast doesn't really do all that much. There we go. I won that time. My positioning, I got the, was able to fix it. Nice. Man, those elf. He wins on the, his screen though. Those elf dodges are so annoying. Maybe elf is more viable than I thought. Yeah, it might be actually. Struggling a little bit on my board. The three star Lilith is tough too now. Yeah, I'm doing okay. I'm just trying to like get the best positioning here. Now that I've got the. Oh, the light somehow I got I've it. Got. Okay. I got it and he lost on his board. I, I did change my positioning and it seemed to have worked a little bit. I'm not sure whether he's facing you or me on his board, but. He's facing you. Okay, so that positioning shift what that? did what something. That? He's actually not that far off three starring his Nightingale as well. Oh, I think I needed you here. He's only level eight. I thought still it's just a level one. It kind of sucks, but it's got to be in there. Well, there's some decent items. There's Tempest Knights. Alright, I got Glutton with uh, with four resistance cloaks now. Reflecting some damage. Actually, That's I, might, I might actually put that on uh, General of War with the t four times four resistance cloaks. Because you're getting him as well.
They're not war? No, I'm not buying it. Oh, you mean, yeah, trading. Let's see. Yeah, I updated his item stacks. He's now rocking four tomes, four cloaks. Fuck this. This is, this is tight. Oh well, yeah, I'm just like crashing him on the board, so. Yeah, I think I had some bad dice rolls that round. I'm gonna Although, gonna yeah, 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 nice, come on. Oh, uh, oh yeah, there we go. Come on. Stunner, 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 there we go, stun, oh. Oh, the shield got up again, come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. Yes, yeah. just in time, two seconds left. My friends back home must be getting hungry. <sighs> I think, okay, the only... I'm not finding Werewolf, and the only other two heroes that I also can't find a two-star are Void, Doom, and Kraken, so I'm slowly just saving crystals to actually try and get to level 10. Yeah, um, right now I'm looking for another Unicorn or another Gura. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So, so you, so you like, keep high rolling, and I'll yeah. see if getting to level 10 can do anything. Come on, RNG. That three-star unicorn will be so big. Yeah. Ooh, good general of war stun. Oh, he three-star tore down to you. He did too. This might be over. <laughs> Yeah, I'm down to 10 HP. Oh, you fired at the wrong unit. <sighs> yeah, I'm not gonna win this one, but I'm, we're not Sorry. taking at least we're not taking like a lot of damage for you. Four, yeah. four damage at this point. Three star sword dancer and Lilith Phil on Twitch. Yeah, he's uh, also very close to three starring Nightingale as well. Got nothing here. And he's got a three star stinger. This is actually a crazy build we're up against. Oh, yeah. Uh, okay, there's a chance I die this round, so that's the f they're the two pieces you want me sharing. Yeah. If, if there was a possibility, I was going to ten so that I could get like warlock out of misfortune. I take yeah. switch it. But... Uh, hopefully, I can stay alive, get to ten, and see if I can do anything. I don't think it, it will at this point, to be honest. Three star sword yeah, dancer. Not firing at the He's got three star, star sword dancer with maxed out great sword. Oh yeah, I just took a ton of damage. Yeah, I'm dead wow. too. Wow, that was. Like bringing up fire up the back line instead of just assassins. That was a crazy. That's one of the crazy builds I've been up against in a while. Yeah. What was it? Did he get six assassins XL? I think he did. Yeah, it doesn't tell you what your yeah. hero was your no, partner was sharing assassin. with you on this screen. I think it was six elf three assassins. No, his hero didn't give him any, so Yeah. Just three three star assassins. And then the off back line, yeah. Crazy. <laughs> he had a fourth assassin. He had a venom too. And then his partner gave him, like, uh, Evergreen and Ice Tusk, so... Oh. How, are you able to see that in that end screen, are you? No, I just looked at it okay, like, sure, a, yeah, a long time ago. Yeah. Old Man G, welcome to the stream. It's a little bit earlier than I usually stream. I either try and go, like, early, early, so it's prime time in the States or later, so it's prime time on this part of the world, but I kind of split the difference today. <laughs> wonder if there'll be another early disconnect this round. Cannot wait to get to level 100 in Chess Spirit to unlock that castle board. That thing is the best customization <laughs> yeah, in the yeah. game so far. 
Uh, you've been trying to get into co-op, but don't really understand sharing of heroes. So essentially on the side of the board, you'll see once we load into this game, there's two little circles and you can drag either a hero on your board or on your bench to those circles and it creates a copy of them. So you don't lose them, it just creates a copy. I got two frost lotuses in my uh, starting shop. Nice. And that copy, you can see it happening there. So it didn't take my heroes, it just added a copy of them to those little slots on the side of the board. And those, when the battle starts, will randomly jump onto your... I'll watch Chaos's board here, so that they will, you'll see them randomly jump onto Chaos's board. And they also add to your, your uh, teammates' combos. Obviously we don't really have... Actually, we do have an early Goblin combo, but that's not because of what I'm sharing. Um, but later on in the game, that can be really useful, getting that final piece of a combo, or sh just sharing really strong heroes with your partner. Uh, old man G, any chance of playing squad? Potentially, we'll we'll uh, we'll touch base after this game and see. I've got Templar Knight and Hog Rider in this shop. Gonna grab. Oh crap! Oh. So now, if I jump across the Chaos's board, you'll see that he now has two humans based on what I'm sharing with him, the Frost Mage and the Templar Knight. Did you just sell everything and uh, refresh from that shop? Yeah. <laughs> I had three goblins and I'm like, well, there's three warriors in the shop that's way better than three goblins. <laughs> yeah. That was some of the fastest ATM I've had to do in a while. ATM. <laughs> Two goblins. Okay, what did I got for Two items? Humans. Freaking random crap. Uh, kind of want to do that. Kind of don't. Yeah, we'll go like this, I guess. Aaron, if you want to join from some viewer games, uh, yes, if that happens, you'll need to add me in-game. Yeah, maybe we'll see if we can uh, queue up a, a squad game after this, is, if Chaos is keen and if ranks allow. That'll be the limiting factor. Yeah, I'm an 3 so... Okay, that will definitely be quite limiting. Even, even only, higher, maybe. I can only just scrape in with, uh, with my bishop. Actually, I might be too low now. I think I'm, I think I'm bishop 2. No, Rook 2, sorry, not Bishop, Rook 2. Rook 2, yeah. That, that works, it's Pawn 3, that won't work. Right, okay. Uh, I have a 2-star Voodoo Elder, so I might now give you Goblins with that. Yeah. I've got oh, a flame, going swords? flame Cooler as well. I don't know yet. Um, okay. there is a third Sork in the shop, so I will avoid destruction. So I do now have the ability to throw three Sorcerers out. Yeah. Sork felt like super strong last time. Uh, last round is just Alpha's Sword Dance. Yeah, that was, <laughs> that Sword Dance was so stacked. No, I was just curious because I got a flame kill armor board that I could resell. Once you get to a higher rate, I'm not gonna bother you now. Like 15% rate, it's not yeah. gonna make a difference if I sell yeah. over or not. But three sorcerers. Yes, okay, I just made a misplay. I forgot you were sharing Flame Cooler with me, so I should have actually taken mine off and kept my Hog Rider in. No. Goblin's not worth not having 
No, it wouldn't give me two riders, cards. and I kind of need the front line at this stage. I think two flame cards is better than like the single best unit in the game you can get in this sound. Alright. So any other hero would have been a misplay, but flame call yeah. was it was the right call. Like Hog Rider's got two thousand HP at one star. Like one star's got eighteen hundred HP. Flame yeah. cards all deals fifteen hundred. It's almost her, guaranteed to get the kill. Her, but it doesn't her cooldown is so quick as well. I now now I have a a, a two star Hog Rider. So now I think swapping them out is correct. Yeah. Maybe. I think double thumb color leveling up would be more correct. Uh, yeah, or even taking next... out your your Templar for flame color might be good. Yeah, take out your Templar for flame color. Just in time. Yeah. Because the goblin still helps them attack faster and get their ult. Yeah. But, like two yeah. rider. Like 25% chance of proc, you might see it once the whole game. Not a big deal. Yeah, sure. Yeah, my this current composition is definitely melting at this stage of the game. You can't beat me. You'll just make me richer. Let's see which one's well, some of us is gonna be a dirty inter faster. <laughs> well, <they're> not, dude. <laughs> This is where I'm like, I'm at 21 gold and I want to make sure I stay at 100. <laughs> but taking the hits more efficient. Yeah. Chuck a tone with my flame that level. as well. So oh, Yo, no one else is six yet. Yeah. Yeah, I got a bunch of one stars. I think I got the weakest guy here. Oh, yeah, the guy's DC'd. <laughs> yeah. Did I beat this guy too? I'll level next okay, round just because it's. Me, so. Oh, no, never mind. Okay. Actually, I just lost on the person that was playing me on their board. They beat me. Only barely, but they did beat me, so I'll drop the five crystals yeah. to level now. Oh, yeah, I get undead. Uh, I guess you get furry instead of general buffer. What do you think of Pfeiffer's recent buff? Me? It's a thing. He, he got what, like 300 HP and 5 armor? Is that right? Yeah, it's a thing. I don't think it's... <laughs> He's still a furry. It's just a thing, yeah. Like, <laughs> he's still a furry, yeah. Pretty much. <laughs> still a furry and still a hunter. Like, neither are good right now. It, it, it's nowhere near what the, like, Ground Smasher and Steel Fist Bus were. Like, those are actually impactful. Yeah. So, another question for you, actually, regarding a hero's ability. The Void Destruction. I was reading its ability earlier today. When it's triggering its ability, the heroes closest to it one square away actually only take 30 damage it doesn't specify whether that's one two three star whether that increases and i did just get the uh, witch doctor profit package again uh what do you think of that of the 30 30 damage ability for those heroes that are one star away from him i don't think that's how it works um I don't, I don't Field deals damage to enemies once while expanding and once yeah. while shrinking. Enemies further away from the hero take 32. 32. Yeah, yeah, I see. Yeah. So it actually, di like, That's... almost has nothing to heroes right next yeah. to Yeah. I, I think because the ACM unit is frontlined all the time, they did that so that you don't frontline it. Right, okay. So I did level again there just to maintain the win streak. I've always frontlined in mind just out of habit from doing the ACM unit. Like never even really looked at it. Yeah. Cause like the ACM unit is the highest HP sorcerer in the game. So it gets like a two star in the ACM. It's, it's like equivalent to like 8,000 HP in here, I think. Right, okay. Who's that so? 
in terms of uh, your approach to econ in classic, so at the moment I'm on a win streak, right? So I'm on 100 HP, it's round 10. Let's say we jump into the next PvP round and I lose. My personal approach then is as long as I've got enough HP to sustain it, you just stop spending any crystals on leveling and focus that's on... That's the correct way to play. It's not okay. the way I play. <laughs> but that's the correct way to play. <laughs> well, it's not as much fun, especially when you come from turbo, right? Because it just feels so drawn I, out. I just refuse to lose, like, you know, unless I'm at 50. Like, yeah. I, I just... <laughs> I don't like to play that way. Yeah. Yeah, which is fair enough. So now I I'm will, actually giving I will flame middle the entire game before I intentionally lose streak. <laughs> <laughs> Even though how <laughs> bad it is. <laughs> I'm actually uh, giving flame caller now, based on your previous advice, one staff and one uh, great sword. Yeah. And if I win this round again, I'll go ahead and level. Ooh, yes. So that the void the void destruction positioning was perfect for me then. Most of the uh, the heroes that hit were right on the outer limits of his ability. Yeah. There's times where shocking dagger is also a good way to go. It just depends on what their natural attack speed is. Cause like if yeah, their natural attack sure. speed is 1.7 or something, like one dagger isn't gonna do anything. Whereas if you're getting like 1.7 attacks, you kind of want like each attack to get you the most possible. Yeah. But as like a, a sorcerer like Void Destruction that's got 1.0 already, uh, a shocking dagger is actually equivalent to like a great sword in magic generation. Yeah. Yeah, I will uh, unequip from Flame Core and switch those now to Lightbringer. Oh, that her ability looks so cool as well. I think my favorite, just in terms of visuals, like not the actual power of the ability, but the the visual yeah. effect of Joey's bomb. Shakaraka's yeah. uh, Whirlpool and then Lightbringer's cast is just unreal. The particle effects uh, in this game are very, very good. Yeah, I'm the Inter. <laughs> Sorry, you're what? I'm the Inter. <laughs> I lost the round. <gasps> Eight one star warriors doesn't do it. <laughs> <laughs> But come on, you got two star ice tusks carrying you, man. <laughs> it's a sad world when he has to get the item. <laughs> like, <laughs> I actually like crit swords on ice tusks, but I've got like three shocking daggers on him right now. Just cause... <laughs> to get it, he's got a reasonably quick cooldown here. Let me check that real quick. Seven seconds, that's not horrible. Yeah. But like, it's, it's, it's based on his max attack damage, like it's a guaranteed crit for 3, 4, whatever, so putting crits on a nice task is sleeper OP. And it ignores ability immunity. Yeah. Ooh, hello Dragoon. Okay. Uh, Good general in our idea. Alright, I've now got 6 humans. Four Sorks, three Riders. So let's actually give up Void now for four Riders. All right, six humans, four Riders, three Sorcerers, two Goblins. Not a horrible build. Means I can sell off the Totem Faces. It was bench riding my bench just in case I needed them. <laughs> Come on, Double Casts. Where you at? Oh, it's going to be close. I need reinforcements. <laughs> Holy crap, this game's almost over. I just want to spend my money. <laughs> like. <laughs> all right, all right. Watch my back. Let's put an end to this. So I guess at this point, this will probably be pretty close to my end game comp. This is crazy though, I'm at six humans, four riders, three sorcerers, and I'm only level eight. Yeah. 
That's why it's a good build. <laughs> so I'm gonna grab the Nether Prince because I want when I get to level nine, that'll give me Warlock as well. Uh, Aaron, sorry, I kept seeing your comment there. I didn't address it. I'll add you uh, once this game finishes, and uh, we'll look at playing another mode. So, just to those that uh, didn't catch this earlier, you can see that I'm equipping my defensive items to Hog Rider, and this is based on Chaos's earlier advice. Hog Rider has a passive, so equipping armor items to him means that it's not reducing the time or the amount of damage it is taking, which actually slows the time it takes to trigger his ability. And we just found Misfortune, which is much better than Nether Prince. So just to just to recap that in a slightly different way, if you equip a defensive item to a hero, they take less damage and they gain mana from taking damage. So if you actually reduce the damage that they take, they gain mana a little bit slower than they would without the uh, defensive items. So putting it on someone that doesn't have a cooldown ability, someone that has a passive, means that it doesn't actually affect the cooldown or the mana uh, ability at all. Uh-oh, this might be my first loss. Come on, I need the RNG. No. Ouch. So, we got sloppy. three dragon, two undead, two rider. What? It's just that he has more two star heroes than me, and I got bad what dice rolls. I'm going to give you Misfortune over, uh... Oh no, you don't need that. I'll give you Hog Rider back. Crap, I missed it. Sorry, mate. Yeah, it's fine. I'm kind of clearing out what's... Where I didn't actually... Keeping it the I didn't check your board beforehand and realise you already had a Warlock out there. Now, this game, all of the casts, everyone double cast. That was amazing. That looked incredible on my board, as just literally every human was just going crazy. Alright, let's just start. Okay. Alright, let's give you two-star... Right two Do you want two-star Dragoon or Templar Knight? Do you want uh, the defense or the offense? Yeah, sure. No worries. Done. Oh crap, what the hell just happened? Somehow he just vanished from the spot that I'd shared him with you, so now you've... Oh my gosh, I have no idea what just happened. You shared template knight. They look the same. And you just shared template knight and sold it. On my board, there's no one in that spot now. It's just a empty yeah, blue yeah. circle. So, like, instead of sharing Dragoon, you probably share Templar Knight, because I know at two-star they both look the same. Okay. Let me, let me fix that this round. There's Dragoon. Drag him over. All right. Yeah. <laughs> they do look very, very similar. One, one has a shield. Yeah. Right, uh... <sighs> kind of want that Kraken as well, but doesn't fit in this build. Just to give you... So I'm actually one Voodoo Elder away from three-starring that. Oh, this might be the last round. Everyone else is, is done. Yeah, that's it. That's the game. Oh, damn. There we go. That crept up on us pretty quickly. That's my ground 19. <laughs> that was a solid performance. So that was so really interesting, like the first actually. game we had, where we just switched builds. Yeah. I had 
Yeah, that's right. You have I was what just I was about running. to make, make Doom and I was going to upgrade General War too. So typically when I run, which, what I was running there, which was, ah, ah, of course, that's what I'm forgetting. It's co-op, so I'm getting the two extra units to help with my combos. Yeah. Like I was giving you General and Werewolf because yeah. you had seven yeah. humans. Which, we, which was huge. I was trying huge. to figure out what to send you better. And I was yeah. thinking Executioner and then General was going to upgrade, so I was going to send you like Executioner instead of Werewolf. Or even send you Void Doom and General War because I was about to get two-star Void Doom too. Yeah. Alright, <laughs> so if I go to Squad Clash, okay. yeah. we uh, should well, be able to run this. The fourth person and like get them into chat. I just gotta go clean up my tattoo. Yeah, so, yeah, yeah no person. worries. No worries. The chaos just like gonna... three minutes. Yeah, yeah, yeah you're good. Chaos just, just gotta, gotta like, uh... run it under the tub and throw some soap on there. <laughs> yeah, no stress. Chaos just got a new tattoo, so he's gotta take care of that. Uh, all right, let me see if I can find one more. Um, Aaron, if you want to jump in on voice comms, let me know in chat and I can sort that out for you on Discord. No stress, no stress either way, but you're more than welcome to if you'd like to. Hopefully we can find one more. So I can't actually go into the chess spirit while I'm streaming. That's quite interesting. Or while I'm in a squad, I should say, not while I'm streaming. I wonder what the reasoning there is. Uh, so Aaron, let me drop the Discord link in chat. So go ahead and... Oops, that's the wrong command. Wrong, uh, wrong symbol, I hit the wrong thing. Uh, go ahead and when that comes up, there we go. So jump into Discord. You'll need to click the thumbs up at the bottom of the rules channel just to gain access to the full server. Once you've done that, I'll give you the role that will allow you to jump into the streaming chat voice channel. So just drop a... Uh, Oh, yeah, there we go. I see you. So, let's give you the appropriate role. What's your Discord name? You better let me know that as well. Just to confirm. Oh, it's Xenomorph. Okay, that's easy. Uh... So once you click that thumbs up in the rules channel, you'll have access to the rest. There we go. All right, I got you. So uh, you will now see the full server and you've also got the streaming chat role so there's a voice channel at the very bottom called streaming chat you can now join that and uh, you can jump in on the stream just keep in mind that it is a family friendly stream so no cursing please there we go Aaron welcome to the squad hello hey mate how are hello. you <clears throat> Yeah, for those in chat who don't know, you're supposed to, for the five days after you get a tattoo, you're supposed to rinse it with soap and water every four hours and then put on Lubriderm or any specialized tattoo lotion so that the skin doesn't dry up. I've seen people rocking, rocking cling wrap over it as well. Is that something that you're meant to do? Uh, the cling wrap is for the like first four hours. Uh, okay. If you're going out in the sun, 
because you don't want to get uh, too too much sun on it. You're, you can put the cling wrap. Like I know my brother <coughs> kept that on because he was he was working in like the sun all day. So when he first got his arm done, he had like the cling wrap on there. But yeah, sure. Um, at this point in time, no one else is responding in our uh, in our squad chat. So I might just are you are you both happy queuing up with the three of us. I'm good. Yeah, we should be able to carry some random person. Shouldn't be too bad. Uh, so Unless they just like ditch us and make us three for it. Yeah, yeah, that would suck. Aaron, you just need to hit the ready button, and then we're good to go. There we go. All right, fingers crossed. We don't find a scrub, and that, they, <laughs> that we have someone that plays the whole game. We just need them to not disconnect. But hopefully, at this rank, that shouldn't happen too much. Like at early porn ranks, yeah. I, I kind of get it. People will be testing out the new mode, not really knowing what's going on. If anyone else is actually watching and wants to, uh, yeah, no worries, old man G. What? Let me know in chat though what your uh, squad rank is, because you can see here that we have a couple of knights that I'm queuing with. So you will actually need to be a rook to be able to queue up with us. Not necessarily. They just need to be higher, higher rated than whatever the highest knights is in pawn. Ah, it's there we go. Two full divisions, so right. Like, uh, okay. I'm, I think I'm knight three, and he's knight two. So as long as they're pawn four or higher, it works. Okay, that makes sense. For some reason, I thought it was only the one rank. As long as it, maybe that was the way it used to work. I can't remember. If it was one rank, you couldn't play with me. <laughs> 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 All right, so I'm, I've got a couple of famines early, and there's a hog rider in my store. Oh, squad has lame eco. Feels bad. Yeah, it's super weird, hey. Three gold in round one. What is this? <laughs> As a pair of steel fists I was gonna buy. But oh, good no. I already. Hmm. I had a whole bunch of random stuff. Nothing that. Oh. What the heck? <coughs> Somehow I grabbed a Frost Lotus instead of a Hog Rider. I don't even know how that happened. <laughs> Feels a little bit bad. I've got two Nightingales, two Frost Lotus, two Warriors. And I'm all over the place, dude. Yeah, i got nothing coming together at this point. Yeah, I just found Devara. Oh, hand. that's so good. <laughs> Hopefully you can find Nightingale as well. I just found out you got the same hand too. <laughs> oh man. Uh, there's uh, the what? early carry. Let's go make something creative. Okay, okay. Okay, I, I did get a two star Miss Supersonic. Warriors are gone. My sword is a combination of my strength and precision. <clears throat> no, Frost Lotus' attack is 1.7. So like a unit like Void Destruction, where uh, Piercing Dagger gets it to 1.0, it's good. But like a Piercing Dagger on Frost Lotus is like 1.5, so crit sword for the a couple. Yeah, well, other teammate is doing fine on his bot. Yeah, actually, I haven't looked at what he's... Yeah, three warrior, two three two beast. Nice. Hey, come on, I might have had... Actually, no, none of my none of my heroes were surviving. I definitely didn't have that. <laughs> All right. Um, I actually have some early cyborg action happening. <laughs> it's funny, all of our team leveled there, but only one of the other team did. So this should be a very good round for us. It doesn't make sense not to level up. It's, Unless it's there's an amazing shop that you have to spend your crystals on. A lot of people like... <laughs> 
say tattoos are like crazy painful. And I don't know. And maybe the forum is just like an easy place to get it. But I've had two on my forum. And like, in, unless it's line work over somewhere that like got cut and you're kind of like bleeding or whatever. It's not that bad. Yeah, right. I, I have zero experience with them, but uh, my understanding has been that they're, they're meant to be quite painful. Like, uh, and then in the shop, at the, like, the same time I was doing it, some girl was, like, getting one done on her leg, and she ended up, like, tapping out. So, I don't know, <laughs> the leg's just worse, but... There's definitely parts that are more sensitive. <clears throat> like, my brother did four hours on his craft, no problem. Maybe me and my family just got, like, higher playing tolerance, too. But... <laughs> how long, how long did this session take? An hour and a half. Yeah. I wonder if anyone out there has got any chest rush tattoos yet. Oh, both of them are yin yang, so they're Chinese, so I guess. <laughs> <laughs> kind of. <laughs> that was timely reinforcements, too. I might have actually lost that battle. <clears throat> yeah, I think at this stage I'm probably all in on end game of cyborgs. I've got all the early game pieces. Just looking for Stalker Drone now. Yeah, I've got four sorcerers already. I've got a Nightingale piece there. Yeah, but I'll leave that. Fine, I think you. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, yeah, I'll leave it at two. I won't get any more. It just came to me in my shop. <laughs> Need one more demon for for punishment. That's a great start. That early devour is so good. It's kind of like uh, flame core, just very strong early units. Yep. Not like I have that either. <laughs> that devour, I got flame core. <laughs> The annoying thing is, yeah. I left two cyborgs in my first shop because they weren't, or one, one or two. There yeah. was at least one, maybe two. Wish I had those now. We're looking good my earlier. Just got devouring. This is set up for a perfect 500, but sure well, I got drone at some point. Hmm. We're gonna go punish it, uh, punish it, and do. My next game to go back in is definitely Totem Face. I don't need to buy any of this junk. Can that build beat me? Probably not. That won't, that won't. Mm. Okay. We're gonna risk it. Risk it for the biscuit. As in staying at level 5 for the Econ? Yeah. Yeah, yeah I did that too. <laughs> I'm greedy. Like my totem face definitely goes in when I level up, but... We're oh. evenly matched oh, in terms of levels. Okay, I'll send reinforcements no, shortly. Reinforcements no. coming in at any second. I don't know who they're going to. Uh, my, oh, my no. is over. Reinforcements <laughs> arrived on my board. Enemy we reinforcements. We both losses because of our <laughs> <laughs> Yeah. It doesn't matter though. Like, you don't... It's yeah. nice finishing with 500, right? But at the end of the day... Your health is a resource, so you can use that to boost your economy. It's the smart thing yeah, to do. Yeah, for sure. Got a second bar. Uh, one more. I have a second flame color. Let them experience the pain I don't my night in good this time. I need my fourth demon time. Yeah, I could level here, but I don't know if there's any point to. I might take a loss because there's the other team is finding quite a few two stars now. But it'd be good to get a little bit of econ happening on my my end as well. My gosh, my opponent has six warriors already. Oh wow. Yeah, he already has a yeah. general war. What? Yeah, that's gonna be tough. Yeah, I Come need on, some uh, I need some reinforcements. I think I'm about to send some enemy reinforcements away. Oh actually. Actually I sustained for long enough for some uh some craziness to happen on my board, but it's going to be a loss. <laughs> I, hate losing. I got that third devourer you want. <laughs> I wish I could send it to you. <laughs> yeah. Share it with me, please. So cool, you can like send pieces over to your team. Yeah. Oh, that'd be amazing. If there was a way to buy something in store and share it even if it costs like one crystal to share it send it gift it or something that would be so good in this yeah. mode yeah 
I Could you imagine mode, how like, broken it would be though? Because both squads would just be so stacked doing that. Oh, we need a yeah. we need a squad who has voice voice calm would be stacked. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, you couldn't do that with randoms. But yeah, I don't care if it like doesn't even duplicate it in co-op. But like, as soon as I get rid of Nightingale, instead of sling it back to the shop, I'd rather be like, yo, here, have two more Nightingales. Yeah, yeah. Oh, and just like amazing. everybody gets three stars. <laughs> yeah, I think uh, I think momentum has definitely shifted a little bit in the past few rounds. Oh yeah. Yeah. Uh, I'm being ready. It. I'm at twenty eco. Yeah, <laughs> I'm the same. I was, <laughs> I was trying to eco to to bears. We got there. Oh no, I'm just like not getting Oh, Demon, come on. Come on, Demon. Give it to me. I've got a couple pairs on my bench that I could roll for and make sure that I won the round. But... How many pairs do you usually want to have before you start rolling? For me, it's four. Like three. Okay. In, in, in Classic, I go at like three. But... Yeah. I don't know, like normally squads, I, I... we got like 500 HP, but I'll, I'll fill my whole bench. Like, <laughs> I don't care. I'm gonna straight up just get to level 10 first, then I start rolling. Cause... I just start rolling at level 9. Most of my in-game comps don't need level 10. Level Like the 10th hero yeah. is usually just like a solid utility hero. And I just felt, I just feel like, once you get level 10, your mana... Yeah. Doesn't matter at 10, yeah. I really want to reroll for my fault. <laughs> I'm gonna hold off one more round, I'm gonna be even greedier. <clears throat> so I just rolled a bit there because I was at 32, so going down to 30 it's an early manner, but then I got a void destruction upgrade. So now I'm back to 25. <laughs> I lose like one gold, but I get a two star. Yeah, yeah totally worth it. <laughs> I wonder if um, if you get an early, early, like round three or four, two star Bionic Ninja, whether you can actually frontline him, because he would just cut through tanks with his extra damage. Yeah. I frontline yeah. assassins. It depends on, especially like six assassins, you kind of have to frontline the melees. Yeah, yeah. <coughs> I always just put them at the back, let them do that thing. Yeah, that's what I usually do as well, but. I've seen people use Lilith as not even necessarily a frontline unit, but like second from the front. Mm. Should I give up undead for three assassins? Mm. Maybe. Yeah, well, I reckon I do. Depends on what assassin you are. They're both. Yeah, you they're both. Get, you get beast too. Right? Yeah, that's right. Gave me beast, and they were both three stars. Tier three, you know, three star would be insane. Three stars, tier three. I always get that wrong because I'm trying to focus on <laughs> making a change <laughs> in my board. It's hard to talk. It's, it's hard to make sense when talking, as well as focusing yeah. as much as of your brain power as possible on making the right decision. The weird thing is, like, I still feel like we don't have the momentum, <laughs> but we still got this decent health buffer. And I guess yeah, it's just because I keep losing we on my board. Boards. Yeah, you guys yeah. are actually carrying at this point. Actually, no, it's, it's our fourth player. He's done 55 damage compared to us. <laughs> oh, there we go. I, I finally have my fourth punch. There we go. Young people have no Very funny. I like that. I like that. <laughs> this is such a weird comp. Four beasts, three cyborgs, three assassins, two engineers. I had weirder. But sometimes when the game just doesn't like you. <laughs> <laughs> ah, can I break my uh, my losing streak? I bought the well. Yeah, I'm just rocking a werewolf as one of my beasts, just because it's a solid unit. Yeah, I should have replaced it for my witch doctor. Oh so no, get the I'm gonna lose the six star too, feels bad man. Really? Yeah, my crossbow is like all the one unit and my totem base didn't do much either. <laughs> <laughs> I 
I don't know, is it just me or Frost Order is very weak early on, right? Like, yeah, yeah. I've almost got a 3 there, but. At 3 there, she's really good. Yeah. Her, her area oh. of effect should probably be larger. Yeah. Guys, I just, I just got executioner. <laughs> oh, nice. That's your fourth demon, yeah? No, that's my fifth demon, yeah. Oh, okay. I'm almost Let me 50 gold. Check out builds. I gotta get the yeah. 50 and then kind of like roll at this level because I lose 7 common chance to get Frostlotus after. Mm -hmm. I just yeah. hit 50 but I leveled up because I, I just keep losing so I need to yeah. stop giving up health. I'll get to level 9 then I'll start rolling for 2 oh, stars. Someone, someone is going B. Six, someone has 6 Bs on this man. He's not dealing that much damage though. He's their damage leader but not... It's only 24. Yeah. <laughs> because he does that tonight. Uh... Gambles oh, on our team is crushing it with his beast comp. Ooh, I just dealt a ton with my beast too. Oh uh, yeah, that that round we did so much damage. That was a great round for us. To fight day. I have Kraken on my body. If what I could give it to you. I've got Kraken, just one star. <laughs> I need to start picking up humans now too. It's a flame cooler in my shop. Feels bad. <laughs> I gotta take it. <laughs> oh, I don't even know if I kill firewolves. Like honestly. Really? Fine. Maybe. You should be. Yeah, good. your positioning is fine. It's. When was the last time either of you actually flipped your position for firewalls in a game mode? It's been a while. I, I used to do it all the time. I've done it once. Yeah. I've done it once. I don't know, <laughs> I don't, like a little bit of fear, but I normally I think don't I learned it really. from your I learned it from your stream and then I'm like I think they I don't know whether they nerfed them a little bit recently, but it used to be tough, or maybe just my skill level wasn't as high, so Yeah. Maybe that's what it was. It's an ACM trick, like it's done in almost a every match in ACM that you like switch it, but... That's the third time this stream I've had a shot with two Witch Doctors and an Evergreen for just immediate profit, I love it. Okay, okay, let's upgrade here, upgrade here... Who do I have some... Oh, one, two, this. the rider for 400. Two actually works... Ah, found Stalker Drone, finally. I can sell my Nightingale. Yes, please. More. Yeah, I did it. I don't think I'm looking... I don't think I'm looking to tree stand, I think, you're I am nowhere close to it. I have... I have my 4 Punisher for Undead, though. Yeah, that's so nice. No, oh, I just got your Devour on my board. He's absolutely shredding. Unfortunately, I left too many uh, enemy heroes up for, <laughs> no, to win, but... Uh, <laughs> the guy has two sheets now. Actually, Dragoon. No, Dragoon. No, no. Dragoon? Dragoon? <laughs> oh, that was so close. Oh my goodness. Okay, there's a Fang Dollar upgrade. Uh, yeah. The beast guy just found his night arms. I found you. That's, a cru That's just a crucial unit, man. Whew. Just got my positioning sorted in time. Just looking for a legendary cyborg now. My build is very close to complete. If I get to level 10, I can add Shakaraka and I'll have three Hunters as well, and that's basically the the ideal yeah. cyborg build with two Warlock. There are times where um, I, I can't find Stalker Drone and I find a legendary one for Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I'm just trying to find Frost Lotus now and then I'm going right to all the mine. It's so funny, isn't it, when you're trying to look for Frost Lotus at level 8, like around 18. Yeah, I'm still level 7, luckily, so... I know. Ooh, I got like 32%, oh. but upgrade is like minus 7%. Mm. Is fine color. <laughs> oh man, I, I just idea what to put that. totally blanked on, uh, I haven't been using my items. Uh, it's 11, 
This little feels bad. Yeah, I can get through all that. Okay, that made oh, it feel that, better. Money, I, I can get some keys. Oh my god, you so good. I had to sell a Moonlit Dragon, number two, to get a Starhorn copy. <laughs> and then I got the Starhorn two, and then I rolled again, got the Moonlit Dragon back. <laughs> so, at first so, it was like, <laughs> feels bad. In ACM, you don't see the same hero in multi like two shops in a row, right? Oh my yeah. goodness. This yeah. beast guy oh, yeah, is... ACM for sure, yeah. Here. OMFSD on the other team is uh, going uh, crazy oh, guys, on my bad. board. Um, he just dealt me 31 damage. That's good. Give me, dead, give me money. Dead night now. Yeah, that's 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 actually a ton of money. That's a good point. Come on, where's my legendary? Come on, why can't I get a frost order? Where is the money? Guys, gotta have it. Who's screwing me over? Nobody. Come on then, give me a guru. <laughs> <laughs> I have a guru. <laughs> I give it to you for what expensive way. <laughs> After this, uh, after the creep round, I can go to level 9. I'll just like, get Frost Lotus with a Guru. <laughs> I need to get these people off my bench. <laughs> <laughs> like, I'm running out of oh. bench space, like, it's hard to roll. Oh no, I'm actually using my ball too. And level yeah. 9, I get 6 human. Who's up against, yeah, it's a chaos. That beast guy is so OP right now. Oh, I actually shaved quite a bit off of him, but. It won't matter, like, they're not going to be able to bring this health total back. Yeah. Two voids! Oh yeah, this game's over. Like, I, I, I'm like hard inting right now. If I go to yeah. level 9, we have, like, I never lose a fight again. Yeah, but you might as well spend on endgame builds right now. Bitch. I have to do it now. Feels bad, man. Or at least level up. No, I gotta go all the way too. I've got them in my shop that I need to put the bench base. Feels bad. Oh. There's Joey. Uh, there My end go. game is complete. Yo, yo, that is so funny, dude. <laughs> just so many copies. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. That's, no what, that's what I was saying. Just, like, I, I, I just had to force a level up at 49 <laughs> because I needed the best phase. <laughs> I could have locked the shop and like waited, but <laughs> yeah, you're gonna have I, to I level anyway, so you might as well. Yeah, it might have been better to do it, but whatever. That was so fucked up, dude. With the bad, <laughs> I just did it. <laughs> I'm gonna use uh, I'm gonna use gurus to three star Miss Supersonic, just because yeah, the game's about to end. Let's think about it. It's a three star execution. Uh oh. Oh, I'm yeah, FSD. Let me look at his build. He's stealing so much. So he's got three three stars out. Just his straight up combo is a six beast four druid, nothing else. <laughs> How fucked it is as a three star knight. Ah, uh, FSD. Yeah, that era. Our teammate, our random teammate, has been quite the addition to the team. Slashhammer, you have nearly the same build as me last game, but I was level 10 and my squad won before I got one legendary cyborg. That actually happened to me a couple of days ago. I was playing with Chaos oh, and some uh, some other guys, and so we won, but I spent so many crystals to find a legendary, and I just had five cyborgs the whole game. That is the worst. I just... I just used Guru for my execution and I found an execution in it. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> I got Jigging to start in my it's shop, set. so I should set this up properly then. Look at this. Yeah. This game is very close to being over. <laughs> Any other items? Health ones? Light up isn't that bad. I cannot believe I just how called much... all my items so that I can put them on properly next time. But I think I did it before the round started, feels bad, but... <laughs> <laughs> cannot believe how much damage Gambles has been dealing. 
He's gonna be over two hundred. That's just beast. Though. Yeah, but the beast player on the other on the other team's only doing what seventy two. I guess we all have stronger so, lineups. He found like his one start night out like very much. Yeah. Later. I love Beast, but my relationship with Night Owl is so... <laughs> <laughs> you never find Night Owl if you're trying to go Beast. <sighs> no, he always appears. Found another G another uh, Joey. Just need... Now I wish I had those gurus back I spent on this Supersonic. <laughs> I'm going to blow my nose real quick again. This cold is still killing me. <laughs> when I'm playing Beast, I never find Night Owl. But when I'm not playing Beast, he appears everywhere. Something... It's not you, dude. Yeah, you say you're gonna be right back, and then you never get your mic, and we still hear it. Okay, then. <laughs> Actually, hold on. Yeah, they're dead. I just killed them. There we go. Hey, I come back to the champion screen. Well done. Night three. I'm definitely giving Gambles a shining nut. He put in some work. <laughs> it is a oh, yeah, yeah. Oh, I'm night four. Rook Lucky two. Holy. <laughs> nice. Sending that. Send this guy. That is crazy amounts of damage. Send him a friend request. <laughs> <laughs> That's someone we can play some future squad games with. Let's see if he took my friend request. Yeah, yeah, see if we can get him in. He see did. If we can... Yeah, he did. So can really? you add him? Can you add him to my room? I'm trying to, yeah. If he's going to. He didn't he declined. He said oh, he Maybe he's getting off. Back. Yeah, he might be. No. You both you both up for another one? Yeah, sure. Yeah. Sweet this will How about the old man? Isn't is he still one oh, oh, oh. oh that's a good point actually. Let me cancel that real quick. So yeah, check yeah. it on chat. So old man G No with these I don't think I can see anyone's um Actual I got squad my Steve rank. Paws. Yeah, I can't see his squad rank. Oh, I can see Paws quite well. I don't play the game. <laughs> <laughs> I play <laughs> Fire Emblem Three Houses. Old Man uh, G, like if you are there. In the in the Old Man Couple G, if you're still watching ago. the stream and you're not in game, drop a message in chat and we'll add you to the squad. I almost want to leave to accept my chest for stuff and come back. Or my chest spirit stuff. Yeah, yeah, like go ahead. Red dot. Go and do it. I think it. I might be able to get the... Uh, I think I might be able to get the... The the blue flash invading. Oh, yeah, yeah. That's nice. Uh, now that Chaos has left, let's quickly load up the squad game. We've got Old Man G, so we've got our three. Let's queue. Yeah. Quick. Hey. <laughs> yeah. Come back quick. <laughs> I'll send, in, send but... that invite back. There we mm. go. Yeah, All right, we got the yeah. full squad. Everyone's ready. No issues queuing. Awesome. Old man G gonna talk? Oh yeah, actually, old man G, if you want to jump in on uh, on the voice chat, I'll sort it out for you. Just leave a message in in chat. Unfortunately, now we don't have a random six piece guy. <laughs> to do 200 damage first. yeah old man G there's no pressure but we just expect you to deal over 200 damage <laughs> yeah no stress we'll, we'll carry the talking for you you can talk to us through the chat yeah just if you got anything you want to say just leave it in chat uh, do I go double totem face yeah ugh ugh <laughs> He does with around to. totem faces. Two totem the opposite. Faces. The opposite side, three of them picked up Cyborg Engineer. Mm -hmm. Just heads up. Yeah, they have to. I'll uh, hopefully pivot out of that quite quickly. It'd be amazing yeah. if they all just competed for that. And yeah, none of them find. There's no way they all find. There's no way they all find legendaries. I picked up a Nightingale. Now I just need some of Aaron's luck yeah. and try and find a Punisher next round. There we go. You should see my board already. Okay. Check out my board. Oi! 
<laughs> what the heck? What? What? <laughs> I actually got myself a, I got myself a three a tier three as well in a Templar knight. That's no Devourer. What? How? I don't understand what's going on. I don't know. If, if, in the past few years, I've been going Punisher. So. If you wanted to, like, if you were trying to run that, you would never find that Devourer. Yeah, it's always when you don't want it. I don't know, like, some, I had a few days, oh, another devourer, I don't know, yeah. <laughs> I just found a stalker drone, I kind of just want to have it on my bench, just because I know they're all running engineers, but I need the crystals. Oh, I want, I want everything at the shop. I saw the, I think, the, not nothing the diamond bar. I'm an energy. Old man G is going warrior, so I'll just go to go to beast from here. Yeah, I think I'm gonna moving into riders at this point. I'm not gonna fight for it. Really, really strong. Same color, just new. <laughs> Wait, <Where> devour. <you're out. laughs> yeah. <on. laughs> oh no! Oh, come on! For... Come on! Oh. No, are you kidding your me? Famine, your famine, your famine came in problem. so big there. Actually, I'm fine. I'm good. Uh, it was, it was. That famine came in clutch. Uh, it looks like that wrong with. Thank you for the follow, AJ. Ajax, sorry, appreciate that. Uh, it looks like at this stage, old man G is going warriors. Who's that summoning me? That's how that round was that my devourer just evolved. Transform into a demon. <laughs> 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 that he got new. Let my blades dance in the wind. That's a little piece really fun. Honestly. I got four beasts. Yeah, so we expect two hundred plus damage out of you now. Yeah. No and pressure. Night, uh... They got a nightingale though, so <laughs> no spawn. <laughs> <laughs> I just, got, I just got devoured on my board. Oh no, that same card just nuked me again. Oh man, he's gonna fight me for werewolf though. This should be the only thing that I get put over. Oh, there's five bees. I may... May end up going into humans at this point. I've got uh... Flame Caller, Frost Lotus, and a two star Templar Knight, so that may be a bit of a pivot. Yeah. I sold out of Warriors already so that he can have them. And the, op the opponent team still has three people running Cyborg and. Uh, yeah, yeah, I really, really hope that's to... it. Uh, old Man G is. Yeah, if, uh, if they run that the entire game, that would be amazing for us. Unless they all find legendaries. Oh, if they all found legendaries, they would deserve that that win. I had uh, two bench famines, but you guys actually need undead. So I sold them. I don't need undead. I normally don't pick up famine for my undead. I just pick up the higher tier undead. If I can. Before the season 1 patch, it used to be so hard to get 4 undead. Now it's like. Oh, it's so good now. It's part of my composition. Yeah. Come on, man. I'm looking for a demon and I get... I got two Lilliths. I have two Lilliths sitting in my store. Yeah, I was looking for a Druid to make Witch Doctor and I get uh... Venom and Martial Art copies instead. But <laughs> I'll take those. Yeah, it's oh, not I had, horrible. I had, I had one game where I was trying to use the... Witch Doctor, Econ, Strat, and I had like six Witch Doctor at the side with no one had a Six on my bench and I, uh, I'm like struggling to pick up other pieces. Yeah, you got no room. Come on, Devara. Reinforcements came no. too late, I think. Two-star Frost Lotus. 
Her area of effect should possibly be like one grid bigger to yeah. make her reasonable. Oh. Yes, dude. I'm a mountain. Omen G in chat says she's going warrior goblin hunter. Yeah. Hello. Yeah, it might just be the. Actually, yeah, old man G, you may want to swap out um, stalker drone for famine. Because you're not, don't have undead think. yet, and stalker drone is. So much better. Well, actually, no, I guess you're in a level and then throw stalker drone in for three hunter. So that doesn't yeah. really matter too much. I'm inting for now, and then I'm gonna get all the demos later. <laughs> <laughs> I, I want my. I don't, think I, I don't think I've won a round yet. Wait, you're, the, you're a beast player, you're meant to be at like 75 damage dealt by now. Yeah, yeah. You'll see, you'll see. <laughs> <laughs> there we go, there we go. 36 beast, I just need to level up. There we go, yeah. yeah. <laughs> Here it comes. Yes. Time to do your... I have all one stars though. <laughs> you can't find my, my other demons. Come on, dude. See, what are you currently The on? game gives me one, two devourers at the start. Yeah. But no demons. I need sword dancer now. <laughs> Old man G is fighting me for ice tossing on werewolves. They're stuck. <laughs> Blame Old man G for my shitty damage. <laughs> oh, that was crazy. <laughs> oh yeah, I want to go. Is he is he rocking werewolf? I don't should know. Be, he's no, he's warrior. no, he doesn't have any werewolves, just ice tusks. Okay, good. Hey, if you're running warrior, werewolf is just such a powerful piece and it gives you human enemies at the same time. Yeah, so, old man G, maybe don't try and three star ice tusk. Chuck that one back in the pool just to give Chaos a tiny bit more of a chance to two star his ice tusk. Although, I'm sure, <laughs> yeah. the, I'm sure those odds are minuscule. It, it, it's it's something. It's that one percent. Because <laughs> warrior, warrior, warrior switches out ice tusk anyway. It should go to ice tusk and banger go out for executioner and general warrior. Yeah. Mm. Actually no, I keep ice tusk just for the beast. Marsler, Marsler. Yeah, I used to do that, but now I'm not so sure that. The damage buff is as worth like ice tusk just is so useless later on in the game. Yeah. Like you get executioner who has a forty percent attack buff. That's like on his own. Yeah, yeah, because okay. the demon buff. I think my six warriors normally is ice tusk, uh, war werewolf, the three epics plus either yeah. general puffer or uh, whichever I get two stuff. Yeah, I think uh -huh. I try and use yeah. glutton. I do Glutton every time because of Misfortune. Yeah. Mm. Glutton, adding Glutton to Warrior was actually kind of broken. Like, Warrior did and not need General that Puffer got, uh, With General Puffer getting nerfed, I guess it's okay to keep Ice Tusk, but... I still... I, I, It's tough to know. Like, he's a solid unit, but I feel like Wukong is yeah. usually just better. Yeah, that's Unless, that too. unless you got like a Kraken best. or a Shark, I guess, because then you want... The Oceanborn buff isn't horrible. Yeah. Just check right out Wukong, okay. was it in there? This gun is good. Ooh. So they've got a couple that are leveling quite aggressively. I got... Oh. I was happy for a second and then now I'm not. I thought I had four <laughs> spellbanes already. I have three spellbanes, two shocking diggers. They must be tampered with. No, wait, one... I'm gonna econ one more round. <laughs> just, just keep my five inches. One of them's yeah, uh, no grabbed your heading. sword dancer too. Fantasy. I don't. I don't have an everbloom yet. Like, what is this? <laughs> I have. I have an everbloom on my damage. <laughs> oh, that's why. <laughs> it's just bully. Fun. I'm just. Get, I'm just getting it for the druid. <laughs> <wait. laughs> 
You got three warrior, three hundred, two undead. Yeah, nice. Yeah, I haven't, I haven't been spending on anything. Oh well, yeah, you you're winning your round. Now now I get all the. Cool. I'm, uh, no, I'm losing my round. <laughs> if we're all being pretty greedy with econ. I just got like six gold I before the round even ended. I guess we should all try and get to level six this round, no? Because <laughs> that level was a bad seven. one. For I, us. I'm going. I'm going level seven next time. Yeah, I'm gonna do the same. Level seven. Yeah, so uh, of course. Ah, uh, old man G1. That actually wasn't as bad, we only lost two. Is someone going Punisher? Someone is going Punisher, that's why it's having such a hard time. Guru, guru. I go level 8 now. Yeah, I'm tempted to just push level 8 as well, but I don't know. I kind of want to keep my econ happening. Oh. There's only one on the other team as level 8, so I'm going to be greedy again. We've got the health advantage. Shakura, I just put it in for fun. Oh, yeah. nice. <laughs> nice. I have no idea how to fit And he takes my witch doctor. I don't take your witch out here. I have just said it quickly for you. Love you, love you. Me being greedy worked out on my board. Sending some I've reinforcements. I've got the witch doctor already. I just need the, the board to do it. Okay. Oh, you, you're, are you looking wasn't, for night, huh? Wasn't yeah. even worth sending those reinforcements. Yeah. Next time, just let me know not to and I won't bother. <laughs> Let's put an end to the <laughs> Finally, another demon after forever. <laughs> I think one more. <laughs> I need Everbloom. Everbloom or Night Owl. Yeah. No, you need Night Owl. <laughs> Night Owl yeah, I need so Everbloom too. too, though. Like, I got Guru, so, like, Everbloom upgrades my. Upgrades my good stuff here. Have you guys ever used the 3 star Guru since the update? Not no. since the update, no. I have, since the I have update, never found my third Since the update, I find Guru on an average of once every seven games, basically. <laughs> that's what it feels like, at least. Actually, that's not true. When the um, when the big update hit the, with the Spirit Pass dropping... I could deal damage if you guys survive long enough to not give me damage. <laughs> When, when Spirit Pass dropped, when that massive update hit, I swear I started finding Gurus like six a game at, like for the first yeah, week. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I had a round where I had like four Gurus on my on my bench. It was, it was, the, it was so fun. I, I had got, a like, round where, I, where I wanted to sell Gurus. Like I had like six Gurus and nothing else. <laughs> I actually could have six. Uh, what do I take out to... Get six riders. Take a look, Nash Lord. Take a look. They must be I still need ice dust. With. Like, what is this? I can't get an ever blue. I can't get evergreens. I can't get ice dust. Got yeah, werewolves with one. Nobody's got any deer with either. Why the hell can I get a ever bloom? I've not seen one in a single one. <laughs> Oh man, G, I would love Werewolf. I'm actually on five humans currently. I need either Werewolf or General of War. <laughs> but I also could put six riders in, so let me check your... Yeah. It might be better yeah. for you to keep Werewolf, to be honest. So yeah, old man, G, oh, yeah, I think you, you should hang on to Werewolf. Though. It's yeah. going to be better for you. I need it too, but like we both need it, so it's fine. Oh crap, I think he just sold it. I think I was too slow. <laughs> What a bad partner. No, that's bad on me. That's on me. That's on me. No, no, I'm telling you, you're, uh, you're, you're I, a bad partner. I can't talk and read chat and make sure my board's good and check other boards all at the same time. Well, come on. Sorry, guys. guys. That's your job. Get good. <laughs> Do your job. <laughs> it's got to be the easiest thing ever. <laughs> You chose the streamer life. The streamer life didn't choose you. No complaining. <laughs> <laughs> oh yeah, double Lightbringer cast. I love it. Although, oh man, the werewolves died before the second cast hit. That's annoying. Okay, second cast is. Oh, I didn't know. 
You know when you accidentally have a piece on the bench that's rocking a whole bunch of items? I just did that. That's <laughs> <laughs> Luckily it was creep round, so it didn't matter, but I have a feeling it might have been the round before too. Into uh, and then I'm gonna go left with him. One more marsh toad, and I get three star marsh toad. Summon all the frogs. And marsh toad is actually it's like such a great unit when he has no one killing his little frog. Yeah, it's so fun. I want uh, three star. I actually, I actually do that too. With like with your build, I always put spell bean stuff on. Well, that's because I got nowhere better to put it. And Venom goes in suicide right now. <laughs> this game is still really close. I just, uh, I had five humans, and so I put Hog Rider out, and then was wondering why I didn't get six riders and realized I was looking at the wrong stupid combo. When I get a sword dancer and I can three star Venom, he's hitting my items. Four <laughs> second cooldown. Freeze everybody. We just lost the lead by two points. There's my six human. General of War, welcome to the squad. There we go, got some ever bloom upgrade. Werewolf, another ever bloom. Werewolf, sword dancer locked in the shop. Good day. <laughs> Still no night owl. Where is night owl? <laughs> I've seen a few of them, I think. At least one. I've only seen one Horn Menace, really? I don't think I rolled past one. Do you, do you prefer Horn Menace or Venom? Because they're both tier 3 Beast Assassin. I play them both always in Beast, so that I can play Sword Dancer and get Assassin. Yeah, yeah, that oh. makes sense. And they're both tier 3s, so they're both worth it. Yeah. No, I actually, my Beast Calm, I actually run 6B6 Warriors. This <laughs> is a really greedy Calm. Well, I do Assassin always. Let me let me just check at the uh, damage leaderboard real quick. Make sure the chaos is getting close no. to two hundred. Oh, no. wait a minute! <laughs> <laughs> I got one star. Right, so. <laughs> now I got all my summoners, but you guys keep losing your damn board. I get I get all the all the young frogs ready to deal damage, and then I get ambushed. <laughs> hey, you're at this point, you're supposed to have enough things on the board to survive three waves of rain. <laughs> <laughs> I just found Shark, so I'm gonna just Econ to level 10 now so I can get him in. Oh, these assassin players drive me nuts. Give me my Venom. Oh yes, these human casts are so much fun to watch. I love it. So much fun watching. So much fun watching battles on Chaos's board because of the, the ice, the snow. <coughs> <gasps> Another legendary. Got two druids in my bow. Like, when if you use Found the, you know the cosmetic the flame collar. Uh, it, it would be cool if if you're using that character, your damage to oh, your yeah, opponent. Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. That'd be that'd be awesome. <laughs> that'd be so good. Is anyone rocking a dark mage yet? I'd love to find him as well. I still have one star ice, Actually, so I was like, where's Night Owl? I need to replace this son of a bit. I'm tempted well, to go... PG Street, PG Street, PG Street. If I find Dark Mage, I'll try and push for six human, six sorcerer, instead of the running four riders. Ouch. I just lost for the first time in a while. I need to replace this very useless one cost unit. <laughs> <laughs> Warrior for if you do so. It's for Russian. Get rid of this. I, I need to light a level up so I get an item. Yeah. I'm like running out of bench space. This is annoying. <laughs> Marshall. <Martial. laughs> <laughs> Wait, you can tree slay your marshal. Why haven't you done this? Venom, Venom. Venom yeah. gets three second cooldown increase. And Mark Lord gets one second. Up. I don't think I've ever seen a three star Venom actually. Yeah, I had I'm it looking yesterday. forward to seeing it. Yeah, three star. 
harm than it is recruit. Oh, yeah, okay, was, no. I, I need more bench space. I have two night hours in my in my head. <laughs> what? Get out of here! I, I'm just gonna buy that show it to you. Get <laughs> 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 my boss. Like uh, sell evergreen. I sell like the night. No. Uh. Bro, no. Six assassins. I mean. This game is still uh, real no. close in terms of health. In terms of health, yeah. Oi, I just got screwed by that guy. A6 bees, hello. Come <laughs> <laughs> on, oh, man. You can do it. <laughs> yeah, give me one more venom and I'll all change. The problem is six bees. the fire this. nation attack. Six piece at this point in the game is too late. It's like now they do nothing. Nah, it's not true. There's, 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 I think it's still... too good. Yeah, it's good. It's good for sure. If I can get star upgrade, okay. like I need another Never... ever bloom. Yeah, yeah. So that's a big upgrade. Getting these marsh lords naturally is an upgrade. Venom will be an upgrade. Horn is fasting and is still one star. Switching ice test and I got an upgrade. Getting sword dancer upgrade. Got lots of stuff I to so... get. I have so many one stars on my board. I can actually swap in, I can make six orcs instead of four riders happen right now, but two of the pieces I'll be subbing out are two star and all the ones I've put in are just one star, so I'm going to hold off. Oh, bro. The other guy that's running Punisher has so much better units than I do. <laughs> 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 it just feels bad, man. Okay. Three star Come, on. Come on. Don't die. That's not execution, you might not be looking for execution. Who's dealing there? Blue. Blue up top is dealing a ton of their damage, hey. Mm, the Punisher blue. Dang it. No bench base to do things, I almost have to make a Marsh Lord. I need to, I need to buy these misfortunes, but... <laughs> You've been sold. I hear you're going up again. Really. Oh, okay. I can buy them when I level <laughs> up. And then I can level up next round. Or after the creep round. I might even lock them two rounds in a row. Just level up after creep round. And then okay, next round, I'll find them again. So we can't keep splitting two wins, two losses, because they have the health advantage. Oh, there's Joey. Oh, there man, we she... go. Should I use Shark I or Joey? Uh, yeah, honestly, no idea. It's your situation. Shark Maybe or Joey? Joey, because your positioning is. Actually, I'm a... I have no idea. <laughs> yeah. There's Venom, Joey. great. <laughs> this is I get so much stronger next time. Like, infinitely stronger. I get warlock or warlock too. I'm just gonna. I've got a guru on my bench as well. Again. So whichever uh, legendary I can two star yeah, first, I'll use. Get him, burn him. Oh get my him, gosh! Him. Actually, I, I just dealt 23 I, damage with uh, sorcerers. That's amazing. I held up my own against blue. Okay, okay. Yeah, okay, this has been a very good round for us. Hey, your demon finisher, come beat my demon finisher. <laughs> 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 Go away. <laughs> that was an amazing round for us. Okay, oh. okay, okay. There's Night Owl too. Goodbye, Ice Dust. I think I'll be using Shark you find because I can two star one? him. Yeah. Ah, nice three star Ben. Yeah, yeah. I get a Warlock up there after the round. Get that four yard interest first. Yeah, dealing when Venom has his ability and he's killing something, but he uses his ability on someone else instead of the one that's killing him. <laughs> oh. <laughs> I see this happens so many times that I got so frustrated. Hey, I, I have 50 mana, it's time to reroll like crazy. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You're not gonna have enough time. 
Ooh, I almost want to put my items on sword damage. If I get two star, I will. I got four shocking dagger for. Like oh, void nebula. <laughs> That's better than misfortune. Execution. Okay. Show you back. I want more. Okay. There we go. Upgrade. Mm. Oh, I need evergreen. Damn, my build is looking so so strong right now. Six human, six sorcerer, two rider, two dragon, and two star shark. I, I spent 50 mana and got one turn. <laughs> oh, you actually did. That's impressive. That's your thumb's gonna have to be sore from uh, re-rolling that quickly. Yeah, yeah. Okay, yeah. This look how big the swing has been. All right, do I now? I use two star void doom over shark, surely, because I've got ooh, general ooh, of war stun. I just got a. Oh, I just got. Oh, I've got two, two voids as well. I've got two down. voids. <laughs> this this build is incredible. I've got three voids naturally too. Check out what's chilling on my bench. I'm a two, I'm a two star my shark. Though, after. I'm my yeah, I've got a I've here. got a two star shark on my bench, but I'm level ten, so I can't actually use him. Hey, drop, How do I get... drop it out, give it to me. <laughs> Are you building him? <laughs> Hang on, is uh... I, I just... Someone else on the other team like... is too, and he's only got a one star, so I think I just keep him for now. Yeah, that actually that's a good idea. I'm not... I don't think I have the time to choose to star him anyway. No, but I don't want to let... Uh, who is it? Fantasy. I don't, I don't want to let Fantasy two star him. So it's just a hate draft at this point. I'm just hanging on to it to uh... <laughs> All right, what do I still need a two star? Just star horn. Come on. Do you need a three star? I just realized I still have two nighting years on the board. <laughs> <laughs> what? Uh, two groups, please. That nighting year just to get something in the board. <laughs> That's pretty funny. But she is a, a decent unit because of her ability. Yeah, but yeah. she has so little. She has so little health. Like. Yeah, that's the problem. She's so squishy. 200. Give her how uh, armor items though. Uh, old man, she, yeah, I got super lucky with this build. This is one of the strongest builds I've had in a long time. We won. Yeah. That was a solid yeah, win in the end. That was me. I had you, the you finally, you finally, finally came through with your too. beasts. <laughs> so let's see. 200 damage? Did Chaos deal 200 damage? Let me have a quick look here. Uh, Chaos, you almost got 100 damage. Because <laughs> 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 you guys blew look. and steal from me. <laughs> oh, that's so funny. I'll have to upload this as a YouTube video on how not to play beasts in squad mode. Yeah, yeah, go for it. I know, like I'm serious, go for it. <laughs> okay. Hey, you're shining that for your, for your... Oh yeah, I'll definitely <laughs> upload this as a highlight, because it was one of the strongest builds that I've personally had in a long time. And you got oh, two that's voids funny. Somewhere. Yeah, I can't think of the last time I had two voids. Had Starhorn, can't think of the last time I used Starhorn. That's yeah, so that's funny. The only time I've ever used Starhorn and the two void combo is when I have Human Sorcerer. Because it just fits. I never really try and force yeah. six sorcerers with humans, but this game, it just came together so perfectly. Anyway, that is it for me. I actually have to have to go pretty soon. So that was awesome. That was a fun stream, though. Thank you to uh, all of hey. you for jumping in on the squad. Yeah, you managed to get online when you have it online too. Yeah, yeah, the timing worked out. So uh, hopefully it will next time as well. If you guys want to uh, say goodbye to the viewers. Bye-bye, viewers. Hey. <laughs> Bye guys. <laughs> Thanks everyone for checking in on the stream and until next time, I'll see you later. <laughs>